thank you very much. Uh, I'll see uh, if I can get on the, uh, the 62 <laughs> with this one. No, I'm just glad that this, uh, this will be here for students. You know, as I indicated, you know, I, I, had to drop, um, I had to drop a class because I wasn't able to get to school and I had to defer my education and defer my dreams. And so I'm, I'm glad that other students aren't going to have to do that. You know, a lot of times students, um, you know, they have to choose between food and getting home from school. They have to choose between going to school and working, going to school and taking care of their children. And so this will help um, alleviate uh, that, that challenge. So uh, thank you all very much. Yeah, when I was a uh, student at Berkeley, my very last year there, I was uh, very excited that we had a new program called the Class Pass program. And it was a partnership with uh, AC Transit at the time, and it was something that all the students loved and used quite a bit, and they still do to this day. Uh, and so when I decided to run for the AC Transit board about two years ago, uh, it, one of the first places that I went to and announced my candidacy at was here at a forum about uh, green collar jobs. And I think before I had even sat down, Reggie uh, had a car business card in my hand, said, let's talk about a class pass for, uh, for the school here. So uh, he was one of the, uh, definitely one of the leaders in making this happen. And I'm so excited that we're here today doing this. Uh, I hope that uh, AC Transit continues to work with every uh, college, university, and school in the area to make sure that uh, we can extend this and uh, make sure that mass transit is a viable option for people to get around because uh, these days things are changing and uh, driving's not what it used to be. And uh, we look forward to working with everybody in the community and our continued partnership with uh, the Peralta Board. So thank you very much. Under the leadership of <clears throat> our former president of the board, Bill Withrow, uh, this all started. Uh, and I know that Bill uh, was convinced through the efforts of Reggie, Marlene, and other students. So at this time, I'd like to introduce to you the former president, the current member of the Board of Trustees, Bill Withrow. Congratulations to every one of the students that um, participated in this. Congratulations to every one of the uh, members of the board, and obviously Reggie and um, Marlene for the efforts that they put on. Uh, we could go on infinitum on this. Uh, Special thanks to Sandra Swanson. It's not easy to uh, take something that is a, a very parochial kind of uh, effort like this and get it through with, uh, as I understand, a unanimous vote, unanimous support. Uh, we're now looking for him to um, pass the uh, facilities uh, bond measure coming up that uh, will uh, mean about 33 million for Laney College. But again, Thank you for everybody that uh, put forth the effort, and uh, congratulations to the students. You probably could not read this from where you are standing, but uh, this is the new Easy Pass that students will be utilizing. On one side will be this, and the other side hopefully will be the TransLink Pass. If not, there will be two cards. Reggie mentioned something very early in the first presentation, that this is a pilot project and that in the spring semester of this 2009, students will have an opportunity to vote to see if they want to continue this. We are much appreciative of the board for coming up with this half a million dollars, but that's just the beginning. The students are the ones that are gonna to have to come in and validate the commitment that the boards, AC Transit and Peralta have given the students. So it's gonna be up to the students really to vote and see if they want to do this. Peralta TV, programs that matter.